Okay, so just a quick video on how to total the value of cells according to their background color. Here we've got a spreadsheet with a load of values. Some of them are highlighted green and some of them aren't highlighted at all. I need a total for the ones highlighted green. So um, the first way to do this would be just to do an auto sum, which works, but it's time consuming and it's quite volatile. If you were to insert another row, um, you could easily mess things up. Um, so it's not ideal. Uh, the other way to do it is to create a sum by color formula. Now, unfortunately, this cannot be done natively within Excel. Um, you have to create your own macro, but don't let that put you off. It's incredibly easy, and it is the only way to total these up properly. Um, how this formula works is you've got equal sum by color, E4, uh, comma, E2 to E52. So what that means is sum by color E4 is, is the cell of which it will sample the color. So it doesn't have to be any particular value, it just needs to be the color that you want to total. So it'll be sum E2 to E52, any color which matches that cell. So the way you create this is by going to the developer tab, which you may have to insert by um, through options and then custom ribbon and just check developer and then you want to click on visual basic the alternative way is to hold down alt and hit f11 and that will open visual basic then you will get a blank screen like that and you need to go to insert module and you'll get module one on the side which will be blank you then need to go to this video description and just paste in that once you've pasted that in, that's all you need to do. You just need to close this now. Don't have to click save or anything like that. And now that is live on the spreadsheet. So to use the formula, equals sum, and there it is live, sum by color. Hit, hit down, hit tab, and it opens up the brackets there. So the first thing you need to do is collect a cell, uh, select a cell with that color. So I want a total green, so I'm gonna collect, uh, select a, a cell that's green put the comma in and then I want to select the entire range of the cells that I want to total. So we selected the entire range. So now within that range of whites and greens it will only sum the ones that match the colour to E4. Close the brackets and hit enter. And there you have it. Um, that's the total as is that one. Um, and now of course if I was to change Let's keep it easy. 200. If I was to change that to a different color, no fill, and then just update this formula, it'll be 200 less. Uh, and as I highlight other ones green and update the formula, these will get added to the total. Um, the only thing you will have to do when it comes to saving the spreadsheet is just save it as a macro enabled workbook. workbook. You won't be able to save it as your Excel workbook or uh, 97 to 2003 workbook so you may have some problems sending it to other people I'm not too sure it depends what office version of office they're using if they're using 2013 um, there's no reason why you couldn't send it as that unfortunately there is no 97 to 2003 macro enabled save as which would definitely open with nearly anything but um, yeah you should be okay but that's unfortunately the only way you can save it um, if you save it as some anything else it will hold the value um, it's just that formula you won't be able to be used again in the next file um, so yeah that's that's basically it um, and obviously you can do this with any color if you make these blue uh, like so and let's make these blue as well then again it would just be equals sum sum by color down tab select a blue one that's good separate with a comma and then just select your range like so and that's totaled up all the blues within the range from there to there so hope this helped and um, I am active in the comments so if you get stuck or anything just leave a comment and I'll help you out best I can thanks